everyone and welcome back to my channel Stephanie's Laurelin. I'm Stephanie. This video is going to be one that I'm making mostly just for myself but it's a bookshelf tour but it's going to be um, kind of just my current summer 2021 bookshelf tour just to keep memory of how, how my bookshelves look now because you might have guessed but I reorganized my bookshelves like 24-7 I love doing it so it's always changing but I just wanted to document how it looks now because I think it looks really nice now and I love how it looks. I have four bookshelves actually. I have one above my bed. My dad actually made that one and then I have three of the Lavia Birch wood bookshelves from Ikea. Yeah I like these bookshelves. I think they're nice. They have the background on the first like cube and also the last cube the bottom cube and then the two in the middle have no back so it's like just the wall which i think is pretty cool i hope you enjoy this video hopefully it won't be too long and i tried to film it in a way that was quite aesthetic so hopefully it turned out okay and i'm going to be doing a voiceover explaining all the books on my shelves why they're with certain things and showing you a couple of my favorite books. So I hope you enjoy this video. As always, all my socials and everything are linked in the description if you want to follow me anywhere. Subscribe to my channel if you want and I'll see you in my next one. Enjoy. So to start off, we have an overview of all of my bookshelves. If you want to see this exact reorganization, you can go watch my last vlog where I reorganized it in that. It doesn't really have much of a system, but I just try to keep all my series together and then some of the shelves are organized by a specific color. Then we have the shelf above my bed, which I'm not going to go into too much detail about just because it's not that interesting because most of the books on there I don't particularly love. But beneath that, there's my kind of collage of fan art and quotes, all the fan art I got from Pinterest. And then the others are just quotes I wrote out from my favorite books and just my favorite quotes in general. This is definitely one of my favorite shelves. It's my Maggie Steve Otter shelf. So it has all of my Raven Cycle books and then also for the Dreamer Trilogy book. And then there's also a gorgeous bookmark that my friends got me that has a Raven Cycle quote on it, which is beautiful. And the quote reads, his native language was thought, which is said by Henry Chang. And I'm pretty sure it's the Raven King, which is the last book. Here is the first of my two Sarah J Maas shelves. This one is my Throne of Glass shelf and it's also another one of my favorites. I find it hard to choose my favorite book in the series, but if I had to choose, one of them would be Empire of Storms, which is the fifth book in the series. And then another would be Air of Fire, which is the third book. And then I also think an honorable mention is definitely Kingdom of Ash because that's just unmatched, you know, it's just amazing. Then we have my A Court of Thorns and Roses shelf. My favorites in this series is definitely tied between the second and the third book, which is A Court of Mist and Fury and A Court of Wings and Ruin or A Court of Silver Flames, which is the most recent book. Directly below that shelf, we have a shelf that holds multiple series of mine, the Folk of the Air series, which I love, and the Hunger Games, which I also love. And then of course my Off of the Game series. And my favorite book in the Off of the Game series is definitely the last one, The King's Men. Even though it is hard for me to choose a favorite, I just love this one so much. And the shelf directly in the middle of all my bookshelves is the shelf that holds my Shatter Me series books by Tahera Mafi. And then there's also just a few bits and bobs on this shelf too. I have some lovely jewelry holders. And then there's a gorgeous pot that I have that has my name on it that I got from school when I was younger. 
And then there's also my light box that has a quote from the Raven Cycle in it as well, which says her Raven Boys, which is one of my favorite quotes as well. And then I kind of just showed off one of my favorite books in the Shatter Me series, which is Ignite Me. Directly beside that then we have my red shelf, which you can see some of the books are turned with their edges facing out, which are books that I actually painted the edges myself. They're not exactly a great job, but anyway. And a book that I love on this shelf is definitely Red Sparrow. It's just a phenomenal book and the movie is also great. This next shelf holds most of my dark spined fantasy books and some books on this shelf that I love is definitely The Host by Stephanie Meyer and also there's my three Lee Bardugo books, The Six of Crows duology and then Ninth House. I adore The Six of Crows duology and then Ninth House. Even though it has such a beautiful cover, I did not love. Then we have the shelf that displays my two copies of the song Achilles by Madeline Miller and then a few other books with white or blue spines. A book that I love on there is The Perks of Being a Wallflower and then I have a little cup as well in the back holding all of my bookmarks and then a gorgeous notebook that has the painting of Lady with the Pearl Earring, I think, on it, which I write some of my poetry in. Then as we move across, this shelf holds all of my pink, peach or purple books. And a gorgeous book on this shelf is my vintage edition of Little Women by Louisa May Alcott. Also, I have a gorgeous amethyst crystal, which my best friend got me, which I named Ataraxia after Nessa's sword in a court of silver flames if you know you know and then of course my copy of red white and royal blue by Casey McQuiston which is a book I love. On the last row of my shelves directly below that shelf is another shelf that holds kind of miscellaneous books that are just have that just have dark spines. A book on here that I absolutely adore is The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo by Taylor Jenkins Reid that I recently read in a vlog. If you want to go watch that, you should. This shelf is another one of my color themed shelves. This shelf holds mostly blue books and a book on here that is just phenomenal is The Miseducation of Cameron Post. I read a while ago, but it's amazing. And then also there's The Gentleman's Guide to Vice and Virtue, which I read last year and I loved. And finally, we've come to my last shelf, which is another miscellaneous shelf that holds my side series books. I have yet to get to the last book, but I'm really excited to. And then also some yellow spined books, one of them being Lies We Tell Ourselves by Robin Talley, which is a phenomenal book. And then also my three Penguin classics, which is Pride and Prejudice, Wuthering Heights, and Jane Eyre. And that's it for my bookshelf tour. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.